Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to find the dog because on YouTube there's not really a com full complete tutorial so I decided I should try to make one because when I was trying to find the dog it was pretty difficult and I needed some help. It's actually not that hard so uh, I'm going to walk you through it and yeah it's pretty easy. Basically what you want to do is you want to go to the strip mall and uh, you just want to get uh, to the wow. strip mall. Yeah. Once you get to the strip mall, you should go to the top and you'll see the pet shop and this dude. So before you talk to the dude, you want to uh, go to the pet shop and buy these treats over here. It's not not that much, it's 100 for like three. So just go and buy like as a few, a lot of them. Now after you buy a few, um, you want to go talk to the dude. I heard my dog was spotted somewhere at the lumber mill today, but I couldn't find anything. Maybe you'll have better luck. So the locations are gonna be randomized, but um, I'm gonna be walking through all of them, and uh, well, as many as I can Bruh. remember, they're probably all of them. Our first one is gonna be the lumber mill. Um, it's here on the side of the sawmill. So the sawmill will be on the highway, and it will be a turn, and you'll see a sign that says sawmill. Once you get to the sawmill, you're gonna wanna go over past the hard hat area and under this wood puddle. You'll then see a doo-doo on the ground, and if you walk closer into the bush, a dog should come out. Now, I am going to be going through all of the um, stages and locations, so I'm not going to feed him like a lot, but like you have to feed him dog treats until it fills up his hunger, and then just pet him on his head or on his belly. I like to do that at the same time like this. That's all I'm going to feed him, because I want to go through more. The next one we're going to be doing is the ski resort. Well, I kind of remember how to do it. I think you might be behind like the tickets booth, but uh, we'll try to figure it out. So just head over to the ski resort. So once you get to the ski resort, you just want to follow where I'm walking. If you go to the tickets booth and go behind it, you will see the dog pop out. Now go and talk to him again. Not talk Bruh. to him. What am I saying? You just want to feed him and pet him again. Next one we're going to be diving into is the town. Now this one's actually one of the easiest because it's also closest. So just head over to the town. Once you get into town, you want to head over behind the spaghetti business or beside the supermarket, which is right here. Once you get over here, you should go over here to where the rabbit race is. And instead of the bush over here, you see some doo-doo and the dog. Again, just feed him and pet him. The next one we're going to do is the campsite. Now this one's also very simple. So just go head over to the campsite. You want to keep walking through the campsites until you get to campsite area D. If you can't find out which one D is, it's the one that has a river and the big sign that says D. The dog should be inside the top left inside this bush. Again, just pet him and feed him. The next one we're going to be doing is the golf course. This one's also pretty simple. I think I remember doing this one. So you just have to go to, all the way to the golf course. Once you get to the golf course, you're going to want to go to the second area of the golf course, uh, which is just over to the right. And just keep on walking. It should be on like a top right. You should see this path and then just exit. Once you get here, you're going to see this bush. The dog's not going to be there. It's going to be in the bush, which is right above it which is right over here. Again, just feed him and pet him. The last and final one will be the racetrack. Um, it, this one is at the racetrack, but not in the area. It will be found inside the actual like racetrack. So just head over there. Once you get to the racetrack, you're gonna wanna follow the dog's footprints all the way up. Through here, and you'll see his bush. The dog should be inside there. Again, you want to feed him dog treats and pet him. Your dog should seem to trust you. Looks like you will follow it back to its owner. How would you like to be the new dog's owner? Well, I mean, you could say no and just come back to him, but in this case, I'm going to say yes, because he doesn't want a dog. 
Please you be certain your dog is, uh, your home is ho dog friendly. That means you need a dog house and a dog bed. Now these items are like three thousand dollars. Like yeah, dog house which is one thousand five hundred. The dog bed which is one thousand. So that's two thousand one hundred five hundred. So yeah, I was kind of mistaken. So just buy them once you get the money. Then um, you're gonna choose a name for the dog. Well, I mean like my dog inside my uh, main account is Travis, but I'm not gonna name it Travis. I'm gonna call it Dave. Bruh. Because why not? That's a cool name. And then yeah, you just sign your signature. Oh my gosh, it's so hard to write in cursive on this thing. Then we get the dog whistle as well. And now you have the dog. Uh, you will be able to learn tricks with him as well as like um, see his favorite foods. It's actually pretty cool. Just remember to take care of him. And I advise you use a dog bowl because it's pretty useful instead of having to hand feed him all the time. Uh, remember to like and subscribe. I'm trying to get to 100 subscribers um, by the end of this summer. So yeah, that's it for the video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.